Residents are hot over a massive rate hike. Cleveland Water says it will start tacking on bills starting in January. The hike will total close to $1,200 per year over five years. Tonight, Westlake residents turned out to find out what the city is going to do about it. News Channel 5's John Kosick was there tonight. He's live at Cleveland Water to explain. John. Yeah, Chris, a letter that came out of this place last week sparked an immediate cry for action among Westlake Water customers. And tonight, many of those residents came out in search of answers. A standing room only crowd packed Westlake's Recreation Center tonight. This meeting may have lasted over an hour, but the underlying message could be summed up in 11 seconds. The city of Westlake is not going to make any decision on how we get our water and what type of an agreement we sign if it's going to cost you more money. It is a point Mayor Dennis Clough would make several times, easing the concerns of worried residents floored last week by a letter from Cleveland Water that said since Westlake was terminating their agreement with them, Cleveland Water would be levying a $291 surcharge each quarter for five years on residents to recoup its losses. There's one problem, the mayor says, they haven't terminated any agreement. We don't quite understand why they sent the letter. We can only guess. Guess number one, the roughly $400,000 Westlake has spent over the last seven years studying the cost and feasibility of leaving Cleveland Water and going with another supplier. So how do residents feel after hearing the mayor's assurances the rate hike will not happen? I'm cautiously optimistic. What do you think will happen to your bill in January? Um, I don't think that it will, will happen. I think that's a scare tactic that the city of Cleveland has done. I'm not at all worried about them you know, paying that. And if by chance they do get a bill? We're going to take it over to the mayor. The mayor of Westlake, that is, of course. Westlake says they have a 25-year deal with the city of Cleveland, Cleveland Water uh, that expires in March of 2015. Cleveland Water, for their part, says that's not our understanding. The matter right now is in the courts. Reporting live in Cleveland, John Kasich, News Channel 5.